Hello and welcome to another Geek Moment. Today we're going to be talking about Linear Technologies LTC 2984, which adds on to the existing LTC 2983. The LTC 2984 is a high accuracy digital temperature measurement system that can be used for any application where temperature needs to be measured and accuracy is of extreme importance. One example where the LTC 2984 shines is in noisy industrial environments like the one we've simulated behind us. Now, the LTC 2984 owes its accuracy to three 24-bit ADCs and a 15 ppm reference for multiple sensor measurements simultaneously. Now, let's talk about the EEPROM feature. The EEPROM enables us to on-chip storage of channel configuration data and custom sensor coefficients. It also facilitates the use of self-contained sensing boards and modules. In addition to that, it comes with a GUI software that allows you to hook up and go. Once you're in the GUI, you're just a single click away from using the EEPROM. Let's see what you get when you order the DC2420A kit. First you will see the data sheet and manual for the kit. Linear Technology gives you links in the manual to download the software. They made it very easy. Then you will see the USB cable and a 14 pin ribbon cable, which you'll use to connect the boards. Then you'll see the DC23. 99A, which is the main demo circuit with the Linear Technologies LTC 2984. Then you will have the DC 2210A, which is the demo board or the breakout board. And then you will have the DC 2026, which is the Linduino one. The Linduino is Linear Technologies Arduino compatible system used for developing and distributing firmware libraries and example code for Linear Technology ICs. Now, the Linduino comes with a 14 pin quick eval connector that can be plugged into nearly 100 different daughter cards from Linear Technology. And it also generates C code which is designed to be used on other microcontroller platforms. Now let's see how they all connect. First we'll take the DC2210A and connect it to the LTC2984. And then we'll take the LTC2984 and hook it to the Linduino 1 with a 14 pin ribbon cable. And then lastly, you take the USB cable, hook it to the Linduino 1. Now that we've unboxed everything, let's hook up the demo. Now I already have the GUI software pulled up, so all we need to do is hook into our laptop via the USB cable. And earlier I already loaded a circuit into the EEPROM, and now I'll show you how simple it is to get it back. Just go to Configuration, EEPROM, Retrieve from EEPROM. And just like that, you got your circuit. Now you can do a configuration check, make sure that there's no errors, and then you can run it. Now that it's running, you can see we're getting 100 degrees C from the RTD that we're sourcing from the fluke meter. It goes through 1,000 feet of unshielded telephone wire that we have Christmas lights in, motors, fluorescent lights, more LEDs, and it goes into the DC2210A and all that's going to be filtering all this noise is a simple RC filter network right here and the digital filtering of the LTC2984. Now let's inject some noise into it. First you're going to get 60 Hertz from the Christmas lights. Then you'll get wideband noise from the fluorescent lights and the motor. All right, now that we have all this noise going into it, you can see the output on the GUI. We're right at 100. 100.1, so we're still well within our tolerance. For further information or any other questions, please go to digikey.com and search the DC2420A kit. And thank you for watching another Geek Moment.